your projects through the urban think tank currently. Question number two, what in your views is the best relationship between architecture, urban design and social dynamics in the city of Caracas right now? Okay, um, Caracas is a city of paradox which is maybe uh, best embodied in the reality that uh, gasoline is cheaper than drinking water. The project that best embodies uh, our attitude towards that situation uh, is probably the vertical gym where we have social responsibility crossing over uh, with questions of uh, tolerance in a 100% uh, violent environment. This project has managed to create a, a platform, a space where different people of different social classes uh, meet in uh, uh, fair play in an architectural environment that has become a place where 17,000 people meet every month, around 180,000 every day. And I will go over to Alfredo Blindenburg to explain you something about the city itself. Yeah, I think it's important to, um, to think about the design politics of design and the design of politics as an idea in Caracas has served us very well to look at this issue from an architect and uncover the layers of, of political division, segregation in the city. And if I just hold up here to the blog, let me just move the camera, you will see that the city has five municipalities. Um, all five of these circles are are different mayors, do not share any political uh, association, are in opposition with each other, and you have these zones, these black shaded in zones, that are the spots of tangency, of connection, and we have been working in those areas, in those spots, trying to find projects that would unite the city rather than divide the city. So this has been our main task as the urban think tank, and the Vertical Gym project is one of them, and it's successfully received in the last year 17,000 visitors. Shown in the 16 Cities exhibition in the Arsenale at the 10th Architecture Biennale. Thank you.